Well, good evening. It's good to have you here and worshiping with us this evening. We don't know when this program will air. I'm sitting here. It's 1020 on a Wednesday morning, and we're recording this because we never know when we may need it. And so we see uh, that infamous S word shows up in the forecast, and that means we, sometimes we can't get together live. And so if that word shows up in the forecast on a Monday evening, we will drop this in and we will let you worship the way that we always do. We're glad that you're here. We're glad that you're worshiping with us. Would you bow with me, please, for a word of prayer? Dear Heavenly Father, we thank you for this time together to worship, to sing praise, to give back to your throne. We thank you this evening that we're gathered together wherever we may be, in homes, in living rooms, in nursing facilities, wherever we are. We thank you that you are in our midst that you are right here with us. You worship alongside us. You sing with us. You uh, comfort us in the good thing or in the bad things, and you walk with us through the good things. And we thank you that you never leave us and that you are here right in our midst. We pray that this time together would be fruitful and pleasing in your sight. We ask that the words of these songs would inspire us to see what you are doing in our world and how you are moving. We pray all of this in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Well, this evening you've got a lineup of songs that I've picked for us to sing this evening, and so if you don't like them and you want to throw rotten fruit at your screen, go right ahead. I'll probably be sitting in, in our living room enjoying this evening whenever this airs with you as well. I won't be throwing fruit at the screen, though, because I'm the one singing, and you know how that just wouldn't work, would it? So, hey, okay, let's take a, uh, an opportunity. Let's worship. And so our first song is The Joy of the Lord. And it's in our hymnal, and it's just a simple little chorus, but we're going to sing it this evening and really sing it out. The joy of the Lord is my strength. The joy of the Lord is my strength. The joy of the Lord is my strength the joy of the lord is my strength the joy of the lord is my strength he heals the brokenhearted and they cry no more he heals the brokenhearted and they cry no more he heals the brokenhearted and they cry no more the joy of the Lord is my strength. He gives me living water, and I thirst no more. He gives me living water, and I thirst no more. He gives me living water, and I thirst no more. The joy of the Lord is my strength. Well, I hope that's the truth this evening. I hope that the joy of the Lord is your strength and that you're feeling that joy this evening and you are strong, singing out proud and loud to our Heavenly Father this evening. Our next song up is titled, In Christ There Is No East or West, In Him No South and North. And I love this last line of it. Let me get my pages here. But one great fellowship of love throughout the whole wide earth. That's talking about our Lord this evening. His love reaches from shore to shore all across the world. Let's join in singing, In Christ There Is No East or West. In Christ there is no east or west in him south or north, but one great fellowship of love throughout the whole wide earth. In Christ now meet the east, or let's start, let's start that verse 4 once more, and I'll do better. In Christ now meet both east and west, in him meet south and north. All Christly souls are one in Him throughout the whole wide earth. 
Thank you for your grace this evening. I got mixed up and I was singing a different verse. But hey, that's good. And so we're singing it this evening, proclaiming that in one great fellowship of love throughout the whole earth. Let's, let's join on our next song. It's Near the Cross. And it says, Jesus, keep me near the cross. And I'll read here the words for you, the chorus. In the cross, in the cross, be my glory ever till my raptured soul shall find rest beyond the river. That's talking about heaven this evening. And I hope that you're ready to go and that you're excited about what is waiting for your raptured soul when we step beyond the river. Let's join in singing, Jesus, keep me near the cross. words and we'll find that rest beyond the river. Thank you uh, that for that request this evening. I'm saying thank you and I, nobody requested. I don't know. I get, I get so much into how it works on a regular Monday night that when we do these pre-recorded ones, I'm giving you page numbers that you don't have and I'm, I'm all over the place, but I'm glad that you're here and that you're singing with me this evening. Our next song is titled, Who is on the Lord's Side? This was a one that we sang here once or twice at West Green Tree, and it was a new one at that time for our congregation, and I don't know that we've sung it a whole lot since, but it has powerful words talking about that we cannot be on the Lord's side and the world's side. We've got to choose one or the other. I trust that you've made your decision this evening and that it's on the Lord's side, and that if you've not yet made that decision, that you will decide now to go to that side. Let's join in singing, Who is on the Lord's Side? We'll sing the first and last. Thine. Dear 
I'm stumbling over a couple words there, but I love that that song has so much uh, power in it as we sing. Okay, our next song up is Worthy, You Are Worthy, one of these little prayer choruses, and we'll sing this and really um, proclaim it. We'll do all the verses of this because it is so short, and I hope that you can use this as your prayer, recognizing that our Lord is worthy. King of kings, Lord of lords, you are worthy. And it says, you're holy, King of kings, Lord of lords. And Jesus, you are worthy. I worship you. Let's join in singing, worthy, you are worthy. chorus there as we sing this evening, recognizing that Jesus, you alone are worthy. Amen and amen. Let's join in singing our next song, and that's uh, 393 in our hymnal, Breathe on Me, Breath of God. And let me get it. There we go. And we'll sing, of course, the first and last of that, Breathe on Me, Breath of God. Let's join in singing. Oh, 
shall I never die, but live with thee the perfect life of thine eternity. Let's sing the first verse. Breathe on me, breath of God, and fill me with life anew, that I may love what thou dost love, and do what thou wouldst do. Amen and amen. Do we recognize this evening that every breath that we take comes directly from God? And we are God-breathed. He breathed into us, gave us life. And I love that it says, breathe on me, breath of God, fill me with life anew. And it says here, the next line, this is what's so good. If God breathes into us, then, then it says here, that I may love what thou dost love, and do what thou wouldst do. I hope that that's the truth this evening. If God is breathing into us, which he is every moment of every day, that we are living according to his will, doing the things that he has taught us to do, and following his commandments. Amen and amen. As we sing that this evening, it's so good to sing. Uh, I hope that if we've done it right this evening, that live chat will still be a feature and be there. Uh, the other times that we've done pre-recorded hymn sing, luckily it has worked. And so we trust this evening that you will be able to join in the live chat. Of course, you can always let me know that you're here also if you have my phone number or you can let the church office know or somewhere that you are here. And we're just glad that you're worshiping with us. And we trust that you will continue to do so on as many Monday nights as you have able um, that you're home. And, or you can even catch this later in the week. I know many folks join us. Um, if they can't join us live on Monday, they join us later in the week. And so we trust that uh, you will find this blessed and um, that it will bless you as you go through your week. All right. Well, hey, let's go to our next song. It's uh, He the Pearly Gates Will Open. And a fun fact about tonight's hymn sing is that every song that we've sung on it, um, to the everyone that we will do tonight, we have not sung on the hymn sing program uh, according to my notes thus far to date. And so we're recording this on Wednesday, February 3rd. Um, and so if if you're hearing this song tonight or wherever it is, uh, up until February 3rd, we had not sung any of these. So you got 22 songs that we've not sung on the, on the hymn sing program before. And maybe um, you'll find a new one you like this evening or you'll remember a song, of, we'll hear a song that you haven't heard for a long time and you'll be blessed by it. Well, let's sing He the Pearly Gates Will Open, and we'll sing this out nice and loud as we proclaim that God forgave us all our sin. so great and wondrous, deep and mighty, pure, sublime, coming from the heart of Jesus, just the same through test of time. He, the pearly gates, will open so that I may enter in. my redemption and forgave me all my sin. In life's evening tide at twilight, at his door I'll knock and wait. By the precious love of Jesus, I shall enter heaven's gate. The pearly gates will open so that I may enter in, for he purchased my redemption and forgave me all my sin. Beautiful.
beautiful. I love the words to that uh, that chorus. Just so good. We're all talking about entering in and God forgiving all of our sin. Amen. Okay, the next one is a good one. Uh, Seven fifty three, and that is. Let's see here. Jesus is coming again. Marvelous message we bring, glorious carol we sing, wonderful word of the King. Jesus is coming again. I trust that you're ready for that. Oh, what a wonderful day it will be. Jesus is coming again. Let's join in singing this great hymn and let's see if we can get it pepped up and really sing it out. Marvelous message we bring, glorious carol we sing, wonderful word of the King, Jesus is coming again, coming again, coming again, maybe morning, maybe noon, maybe is coming again, coming again. Amen. Hallelujah. Jesus is coming again. What a wonderful thought this evening to know he is coming again. All right. Well, let's keep on going. Another one of these songs out of our hymnal that we sing sometimes and our congregation really enjoys is The Battle Belongs to the Lord. And I think we'll do all of the verses of this one. And this may be uh, new to some of you. Maybe some of you will know it and you'll really enjoy it. And we're going to just sing this one proclaiming that this battle of flesh and blood here on this earth is not ours to fight, but rather the one who lives in us fights it for us. And so this evening we're trusting that God will fight the battle for us. Our enemies may surround us and, and the foe might be nigh, uh, but you know what? Our Lord fights the battle for us because this battle belongs to him. So this evening, let's sing it out. We sing the chorus. It sets you up good. So you better sing out on this one. It says, and we sing glory, honor, power, and strength to the Lord. And then it says it one more time. We sing. And so I want you to really shout it out on that. We sing glory, honor, power, and strength to the Lord. Let's sing it out and really Really uh, let the whole earth know that the battle belongs to the Lord. against us will stand the battle be
fades in like a flood. The battle belongs to the Lord. He's raised up a standard, the power of his blood. The battle belongs to the Lord. And we sing glory, honor, power and strength to the Lord. We sing is in heart do not fear the battle belongs to the lord take up my friend your redemption is near the battle belongs to the lord and we sing glory honor power and strength to the lord we sing glory honor power and strength to the lord Let's sing that third verse one more time. When your enemy presses in hard, do not fear. The battle belongs to the Lord. Take courage, my friend, your redemption is near. The battle belongs to the Lord. And we sing glory, honor, power, and strength to the Lord. We sing strength to the Lord. I just felt the power as we sang that third verse. When your enemy presses in, do not fear. Do you believe that this evening? Are you trusting that we do not fear? I hope you are in this evening that you're holding fast to that knowing that we have nothing to fear when we are in the perfect love of God, because that perfect love that comes from him casts out all fear. So this evening, my friends, the battle belongs to the Lord. All right. Well, hey, let's take a look at our next song. It's titled Christ Arose. And I know this under a couple different titles. I know it under Christ Arose. That's what it's in our hymnal as. And I know it also as Low in the Grave He Lay. And then there's also a third title that I know this song as. I know it as the Gravy Song. And people will say, well, the gravy song, what, what is that supposed to mean? The gravy song. There is no gravy song. And it's the song that says, up from the gravy arose. And so if you don't enunciate it well enough, it is the gravy song. And so this evening, I hope that you are ready to sing it because this is one of my favorites. We're going to do all the verses on this one too. I love that chorus. Up from the grave he arose he, with a mighty triumph o'er his foes. He arose a victor from the dark domain, and he lives forever with his saints to reign. He arose. He arose. Hallelujah. Christ arose. I hope that that is your heart cry this evening. We're just talking about the battle belongs to God. Well, he overcame his foes, and he arose. Let's join in singing it. When we get to that chorus, really sing it out. I want to see if I can hear you from wherever I'm listening when this airs. And so sing it out. Maybe you'll want to stand as you sing this. You never know. Let's join in singing it loud and proud. Christ arose. <laughs> grave he lay Jesus my Savior waiting the coming day Jesus my Lord up from the grave he arose with a mighty triumph for his foes he arose a victor from the dark domain and he lives forever with his saints to reign. He arose, he arose, hallelujah, Christ arose. Vainly they watch his bed, Jesus my Savior. Vainly they seal the dead. Jesus, my Lord, up from the grave he arose with a mighty triumph for his. 
his foes. He arose a victor from the dark domain, and he lives forever with his saints to reign. He arose, he arose, hallelujah, Christ arose. Death cannot keep his prey. Jesus, my Savior, he tore the bars away. Jesus, my Lord, up from the grave he arose with a mighty triumph for his foes. He arose a victor from the dark domain and he lives forever with saints to reign. He arose, he arose, hallelujah, Christ arose. Amen and amen, Christ arose, hallelujah, Christ arose. All right, well, the next one up that we're going to sing this evening is uh, one that I was not real familiar with. I'm still not that familiar with it, but we're going to try it out and see how it goes. It's titled Learning to Lean. I'm learning to lean on Jesus, finding more power than I'd ever dream. And that's because I'm learning to lean on Jesus. Let's, oh, I, I'm sorry, I missed the hymn sing request slide. So if you have a hymn sing request, Whenever this airs or whenever we go live any Monday night, you can submit a request at westgreentree.org slash hymnsing. You can also call the church office and talk to our lovely administrative assistant, Paula Jones. And I know she's over there right now as, as I'm recording this. And uh, you can call her at 717-653-5367. Look, Paula, come on. Come on, camera. No, no she... <laughs> she doesn't want to. <laughs> she came out and made faces at me. You know Paula. We love our Paula. All right. Well, hey, let's continue right along learning to lean and see how we do with it this evening. If we can sing it out and if you know it better than I do, but let's have a good time as we worship. begin with the chorus. I'm learning to lean, learning to lean, learning to lean on Jesus, finding more power than I'd ever dreamed. I'm explain fills my soul since the day I made Jesus my King. His blessed Holy Spirit is leading my way. He's teaching and I'm leaning to lean. I'm learning There's glorious victory each day now for me. I found his peace so serene. He helps me with each task, if only I'll ask. Every day now I'm learning to lean. I'm learning. I'm 
I get tripped up in some of the words of that too because there's too many L words close together, learning, leaning, so I'm saying them wrong. But hey, that's a good song. I'm glad that we sang that this evening and that we are able to worship through that learning to lean on Jesus Christ. Amen. All right, our next one up is one too that I'm not super, super familiar with, but it was one that uh, intrigued me as I was paging through the hymnal, coming up with the lineup for this program, and it's titled Sweet Beulah Land. And so we've sung on our program a number of times, uh, uh, the regular Beulah Land, um, that's the I've Reached the Land of Corn and Wine, uh, Beulah Land, and then we've also sung Dwelling in Beulah Land, and but we never did um, Sweet Beulah Land. And so this evening I'm going to see how this one goes also. Sweet Beulah Land, I'm kind of homesick for a country to which I've never been before. No sad goodbyes will there be spoken, for time won't matter anymore. Let's see how we do with this Sweet Beulah Land this evening. <laughs> Wow, the power just resonates with me as we sing about that, a land that we are waiting for, that we are trusting, uh, that we will end up someday in. And if we've given our life to Jesus, we know it's not even a, um, a thought that, are we going to get there if we've trusted Jesus? It's a matter of when we get there. And I'm, I'm thankful that we sung that this evening. Again, that was new for me, so I probably didn't do it perfectly perfectly. But hey, we're singing together, we're worshiping the Lord, and that's what our Father asks, is that we come before him with sincere hearts, 
worshiping and loving him. And so this evening, thank you for singing that with me. I just uh, love the words to that, really. All right. Well, the next one up is All the Way My Savior Leads Me. And so we'll sing this one this evening a little more familiar to a lot of us. And we'll sing it, For I know what e'er befall me. Jesus doeth all things well. And then this last verse, the, the words at the end, This my song through endless ages, Jesus led me all the way. I trust we're following God's leading this evening and that we'll sing this and proclaim it and thank him for leading us where he does. Let's join in singing. All the way my Savior leads me, what have I to ask beside? Can I doubt his tender mercy, who through life has been my guide? Heavenly peace, divinest comfort, here by faith to him to dwell. For I know whate'er befall me, Jesus doeth all things well. For I know doeth all things well. All the way my Savior leads me, oh, the fullness of his love, perfect rest to me is promised in my Father's house above. When my spirit clothed immortal, wings its flight to realms of day. This my song through endless ages, Jesus led me all the way. This my song through endless ages, Jesus led me all the way. Beautiful words. Jesus led me all the way. And this evening, what I love here, again, in our hymnal, I think I've referenced it a time or two before, is under every title and the number of the song, it gives a scripture. And this is Psalm 48, verse 14. Our God will be our guide, even to the end. Are you trusting that this evening, following his leading through all the things? Some of the songs refer to it as the stormy blast, and then uh, the way is clear, the the narrow, or the, the way is... Um, well, you know how it is. The way is clear sometimes. The way is thorny other times. But God leads us through all things. Because when he is our guide, he's not leaving us. He's not forsaking us. He is walking with us. And so we're thankful that all the way our Savior leads us. And he will lead us all the way. And we can trust him each and every step. All right. Well, our next one up is Something Beautiful. That's the name of the song. One of these choruses in our hymnal. And so we'll sing this two times. This is one of our Masonic Village friends when I would play with them that uh, they would really love this chorus. And so we'll sing it twice, Something Beautiful. Strife, 
but he made something beautiful of my life but he made something beautiful of my life I love that and everything that we offer to our Lord uh, could be brokenness and strife and somehow in his great love for us he made something beautiful of our life. That's just so great to think of all the things that I've done that that you've done. If you count the sum of all of your sins to realize that God is not even going to, they're going to, they're going to go away because of the price that was paid. And so he makes something beautiful out of this unbeautiful person that I am. Amen and amen that a life would be transformed. Wow, what a thought this evening to really focus on. That he takes our brokenness, our dirtiness, our confusion, our strife, everything, and makes something good out of this life. Amen. All right, let's go to Freely, Freely, one of these choruses that we love to sing so much, just a good one. God forgave my sin in Jesus' name, and I've been born again in Jesus' name. And I love this chorus. He said, Freely, Freely, you have received. That's the free gift. Do you know that? The free gift. Not a lot of things in this world are free. You have to pay for gasoline. You have to pay for food. You have to pay for uh, the house that you live in. All kinds of things. But you don't have to pay for eternal life this evening because Jesus paid it for you. Go in my name and because you believe, others will know that I live. I hope that we're the rare, very reflection of Christ Jesus in the world around us that others will know that he lives. And I'm going to get a sip of water here, and we will begin with Freely, Freely. All right, let's sing it. God forgave my sin in Jesus' name. I've been born again in Jesus' name. And in Jesus' name, I come to you to share his love as he told me to. He said, Amen, and others will know that he lives. All right, we're going to go to Pass Me Not, O Gentle Savior. One of these camp meeting kind of songs, a good one for an invitation. Pass me not, do not pass me by while others thou art calling. Do not pass me by. Let's sing it out and really proclaim it. Pass me not, O Gentle Savior. and 
gentle Savior, hear my humble cry. While on others thou art calling, do not pass me by. Savior, Savior, hear my humble cry. While on others thou art calling, do not pass me by. Thou, the spring of all my comfort, more than life to me. I on earth beside me, whom in heaven but thee, Savior, Savior, hear my humble cry, while on others thou art calling, do not pass me by. Beautiful words this evening. Amen. All right, another good song, a um, great hymn, really good one, and one that I don't even play very often, but I like, is O oh, to be like thee. O oh, to be like thee, blessed Redeemer, pure as thou art. Come in thy sweetness, come in thy fullness. Stamp thine own image deep on my heart. Let's join in singing this great hymn. Oh, to be like thee. Oh, to be like thee, blessed Redeemer, this is my constant longing and prayer. I'll forfeit all of earth's treasures. Jesus is perfect like this to wear. Oh, to be like thee, oh, to be like thee, blessed Redeemer, pure as thou art. Come in thy sweetness, come in thy fullness. Stamp thine own image deep on my heart. Oh, to be like thee while I am pleading, pour out thy spirit, fill with thy love. Make me a temple, meet for thy dwelling, fit me for life. Above. Oh, to be like thee, oh, to be like thee, blessed Redeemer, pure as thou art. Come in thy sweetness, come in thy fullness, stamp thine own image deep on my heart. I love that thought, stamping God's own image deep on our heart. Amen and amen. All right, our next one is, Lord, I lift your name on high. And this is a newer song, but I remember singing it growing up, and I just remember there's a set of motions that go with the chorus, and obviously I don't have four hands to be able to do them, but if you know them, I invite you to do them as we sing it. And we'll sing this through two times. Lord, I lift your name on high. All right, here we go. Lord, I lift your name on high. Lord, I love to sing your praises. I'm so glad you're in my life. I'm so glad you came to save us. You came 
from heaven to earth to show the way from the earth to the cross my debt to pay from the cross to the grave from the grave to the sky lord i lift your name on high lord i lift your name on high Amen. Lifting God's name on high this evening. What a blessed thing to do. All right. We are down to four more songs, the next of which Jesus loves even me. And in fact, I think that this is one, sometimes when we're singing this at church, um, I make them sing it again. And I don't know, maybe that's a bad thing, but the chorus says, I am so glad that Jesus loves me. Jesus loves me. And then again, I am so glad that Jesus loves me. Jesus loves even me. And the thing about it is it says, I am so glad. And so if you're glad, you need to have a smile on your face when you sing this. So this evening, I'm going to sing it with a smile on my face and maybe it'll sound really bad, but I'm going to sing it with a smile on. And so I hope that you get a smile on your face and really smile as we sing it because we are so glad that Jesus loves even me. Let's join in singing. I'm so glad that our Father in heaven Hills of his love in the book he has given Wonderful things in the Bible I see This is the dearest that Jesus loves me I am so glad that Jesus loves me Jesus loves me, Jesus loves me I am so glad that Jesus loves me Jesus loves even me. Oh, if there's only one song I can sing, when in his beauty I see the great King, this shall my song in eternity be. Oh, what a wonder that Jesus loves me. I am so glad that Jesus loves me. Jesus loves me. Jesus loves me. I am so glad that Jesus loves me. Jesus loves even me. And so I hope that that brings a smile to your face because Jesus loves even me and he loves you too. All right. Our next song up is My Hope is in the Lord. I'm going the wrong way with my pages. I'll take this chance or this opportunity. Again, if you're able, please put in the live chat that you're here. And uh, I hope that we will already have had guesses going on for some occupations like we do each week. And we trust that as soon as possible, we will be back together for live hymn sing. It just isn't the same. I know it probably doesn't feel any different um, to my mind in, in one way because I'm still sitting here in an empty sanctuary. But it is different because I'm not able to see that you're engaging with our program and singing along this evening. And so, but in due time, this will air and then we will sing together and it will be no different. All right. Well, let's continue right along. My hope is in the Lord. This has some nice parts. If you're an alto tenor or bass and you know the parts, I invite you to sing it out nice and loud. And let's sing My Hope is in the Lord. My hope is in the Lord who gave himself for me and paid the price of all my sin at Calvary for me. 
mind but to believe and recognize his work of love and Christ receive for me he died for me he lives and everlasting light and life he frees Amen, amen. My hope is in the Lord. I notice a number of our songs this evening talk about our life, giving us life. That is true. To have Christ is life. Amen. And so our final, our second to last song, rather, is I'll Live for Him. And we'll sing the first and last of this beautiful little song. One of my favorite memories of this song is seeing a video of my great uncle George Arndt and great aunt Joan Arndt, and they were leading worship at their church in Lake Placid, Florida. And uncle George is the song leader and he really gets into it. His hands are going and he's singing and aunt Joan's standing next to him and she's singing harmony. And it was just such a beautiful thought. And so I don't know, maybe someday we'll get them on our program if they ever get up here from sunny Florida. Maybe they don't want to come with all this snow on the ground, but hey, well, maybe we can get them here, and if so, that would be great, and have them sing this with us. But this evening, you've just got me, so let's join in singing, I'll Live for Him. My life, my love, I give to Thee, Thou Lamb of God, who died for me. My Savior and my God. I'll live for Him who died for me. How happy then my life shall be. I'll live for Him who died for me. My Savior and my God. Oh, Thou who died on Calvary, Save my soul and make me free. I'll consecrate my life to thee, my Savior and my God. I'll live for him who died for me. How happy then my life shall be. I'll live for him who died for me, my Savior and Beautiful words this evening as we're singing it out. We've got one song left as we close our program, and it's titled, He is Lord. Now, if you think of He is Lord, actually, I'm going to need my hymnal. I don't know why I'm putting it away. When I think of He is Lord, I think of just the chorus, He is Lord, but there's more to it. I found out that there are verses to it, and so this evening we're going to sing it with the verses. And so, the, the verses tell a nice story, and then, of course, they transition into the chorus that we all know. And so let's, let's sing it out, and we're going to sing the entire song, so we'll do the three verses and the chorus. All right, let's join in singing. Of his glory, God became a man to walk on earth in ridicule and shame. A ruler, yet a servant, a shepherd, yet a lamb, a man of sorrows, agony, and pain. He is Lord, he is Lord. dead and he is Lord. Every knee shall bow, every tongue confess that Jesus 
Jesus Christ is Lord. Humbled and rejected, beaten and despised, upon the cross the Son of God was slain. Just like a lamb to slaughter, a sinless sacrifice, but by his death his loss became our gain. He is Lord, he is Lord. He is risen from the dead, and he is Lord. Every knee shall bow, every tongue confess that Jesus Satan's forces crumbled like a mighty wall. The stone that held him in was rolled aside. The prince of life and glory was lifted over all. Now earth and heaven echoes with the cry. He is Lord. Well, this evening, as we prepare to go from this place, we thank you for worshiping with us in this pre-recorded hymn sing. We trust that as soon as possible, we will be back together live. And so this evening, I want you to look at these verses as our benediction. Satan's forces crumbled like a mighty wall. The stone that held him in was rolled aside. The prince of life in glory was lifted over all. Now earth and heaven echoes with the cry. And then, of course, as we sang, he is Lord. He is Lord. He is risen from the dead, and he is Lord. And we sang about it earlier, and when he comes back, this is going to be a beautiful sight for everyone who believes in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, that every knee on heaven and earth shall bow, and every tongue will confess, and we will hear it all. We will see it all. His glory will be revealed to all people that Jesus Christ is Lord. I hope this evening that if you have heard the joyful sound that Jesus saves, that you will confess him as your Lord and Savior, recognizing that he is Lord over all of creation, from everlasting to everlasting. Our Lord reigns, and he is Lord. This evening, go in the peace of knowing that he is Lord. Amen. Thank you.